Hello, I am Von Kenneth D. Alberto from BSMT 3A4. Today, I'm going to discuss about the fixing vessel's position by radar observation. How to get range and bearing in ARPA. Transmit. Transmit is used to turn on the radar or ARPA and also used to set up the radar screen display and information system. Gain. Gain is used to enhance the target or echo, and it adjusts the reception and receiver sensitivity. Rain control. Rain control is used to adjust or reduce clutter from rain, snow, or clouds. Sea control. Sea control is used to adjust or reduce sea clutter from high waves. Getting the range and bearing in ARPA. To get the range and bearing in ARPA, there are three methods used, the EBL, VRM, and Cursor. In this picture, EBL1 is used. In this picture, EBL1 is turned on, and there is a yellow line, and EBL1 is 5.0 degrees true. Now, EBL and VRM is turned on. EBL is 43.8 degrees true, while VRM is 9.0 nautical miles. VRM1 is also turned on. As you can see, there is a yellow small circle in the middle and VRM1 is 2.50 nautical miles. The range of the target in the north is 9.86 nautical miles and bearing of 7.8 degrees true. EBL1 and VRM1 is used. VRM2 is another way to get the range of other targets, especially when more than two. We can also use the cursor to get the range and bearing of a target. EBL1, VRM1, and cursor are all used to get the range and bearing of the target in the north. Bearing is 7.8 degrees true and the range is 9.01 nautical miles. With the same method, to get the range and bearing of the target in the northeast. To move or change the EBL and VRM position, use left click and press or hold and drag them to the target in northeast or any of your choice. Using the same method, the bearing of the target in southeast is 134.8 degrees true and its range is 5.24 nautical miles. Using the same method, the bearing of the target in the southwest is 201.2 degrees true and its range is 7.39 nautical miles. Using the same method, the bearing of the target in the northwest is 346.2 degrees true and its range is 10.11 nautical miles. Using the same method, the bearing of the other targets in the northwest is 346.17 true and its range is 9.52 nautical miles. Using the same method, the bearing of the target in the southeast is 134.5 degrees true and its range is 5.94 nautical miles. Center Center is used to put your radar display at the center. It's also used to adjust the view of your radar or ARPA screen. Max view Max view is used to increase or decrease the radar or ARPA view. Just use the left click, then select or drag the view of your choice, and it will shift. In this picture, the view is increased and extended in the forward view of the center or north view of the radar display. Click again the center, and the radar display will go back again to the center. Range ring. RR means range ring. Those are the rings seen in the picture. The cleast of each range ring is 2 nautical miles. You can also turn off the range rings. In this picture, the range ring is off. Enhance. Enhance is used for adjusting the radar screen display. Enhance make the target more larger and bolder. Enhance is turned on to make the targets more visible and clear. Medium Pulse 
MP means medium pulse. It determines the distance of wavelength and rings in the radar or ARPA display. It is used per medium range or distance. Long pulse. LP means long pulse. Same use and meaning with LP, but LP is used per long range and distance. Standby. Standby is used to stop the radar or the ARPA from transmitting informations and signals and etc. Turning off. Before turning off the radar, make sure it is in the standby mode and all set up are on the original position. So that's all on how to get range and bearing in ARPA. Again, this is Midshipman Von Kenneth D. Alberto from BSMT 3A4. Thank you and God bless.